Today we're going to do something a little different. We're going to have a story time. Ooh. But instead of reading one of my published books, I'm going to read a book that's never been published. As an author, I come up with a lot of ideas and I write them down and then I send them to my publisher and agent and they tell me if it's good or not. They ask you to draw the pictures, not just write what's going to happen. It's true. I write the words and draw the pictures. So this is called a book dummy, but it's not impolite to say that. This is like a little printout of what the book would look like. Ollie did a good job of coloring it with me today. Yeah. So you get a full color dummy. Mm -hmm. And this book is called The Very, Very Scary Skeleton by Jeff Chekai. One comment. Yes. It doesn't look very scary. Well, let's see. It probably is. On a dark night, a skeleton emerges from the ground. But this is no ordinary skeleton. This is a very, very scary skeleton. And this very, very scary skeleton has but one thing on its mind. Scaring! A fuzzy bunny will be an easy first target. Nibble, 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 nibble. Boo! Nibble, nibble. Huh? Okay, I admit the fuzzy bunny doesn't look very frightened. But very, very scary skeleton, you should never give up on your mission to startle. Sure, it will be more difficult to terrify someone while holding a fuzzy bunny, but I know you are up for the challenge. Look, it's a basket full of adorable kittens. It's scaring time. Boo! Yes, holding a fuzzy bunny while also being followed by five adorable kittens may pose a spooking challenge for some, but not for you, very, very scary skeleton. Aha! Look at those innocent picnickers. All you'll need to do is to crawl through the field of flowers, leap out, and give them the fright of their lives. Sniff, sniff, sniff. Do you smell lavender? Yes, it's very soothing. Boo! Hi! Please join our picnic. Even very, very scary skeletons need to eat. Munch, 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 munch. I know that you're feeling frustrated, very, very scary skeleton. After all, you are holding a bunny. You are being followed by kittens. You do smell like flowers. And you definitely have a tummy full of delicious cucumber and cream cheese sandwiches. And those things may make scaring difficult for a regular skeleton. But you are no regular skeleton. You are the very, very scary skeleton, and you should never, ever doubt your ability to strike fear into the hearts of all who gaze upon you. Now let's get scaring. So first he goes into the cupcake shop. Boo! Goes into the t-shirt shop. Boo! Goes into the balloon shop. Boo! He goes into the roller skate shop. Boo! See how he did? Okay, just because you are being followed by kittens and a bunny, smell like flowers, have a tummy full of delicious sandwiches, are wearing a smiley face t-shirt, are carrying heart-shaped balloons and a plate of pink frosted cupcakes, and are roller skating through the park underneath an absolutely breathtaking rainbow, does not mean, oh, very, very scary skeleton. I hate to be the bearer of bad news but you might not be as scary as we thought you were. Lick, lick, lick. Aw, oh, don't cry, very, very scary skeleton. It'll be okay. Wah, wah. Look, you're surrounded by all your friends. There's more to life than scare. Boom! Ee, 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 da! Zip. Well, now look what you've done. You've scared away your new friends. Just kidding. We are so proud of you. We know, knew you could do it, very, very scary skeleton. It says congratulations on your first scare. The end. Let me know what you think. We realized, Ollie and I realized, 
Last episode, I think we told you you should comment in the in the comment field below. But you can't. But you can't comment on kids' videos. But you can email us, right? Email us your pictures. Tell me what you thought of the book. If you're a publisher and want to publish the book, uh, you can tweet me a contract. And uh, we'll see you next time on Drawing with Ollie. And Jeff. And Jeff. Right.